This puzzle has many variations and is one of the top interview puzzles to be asked. In fact, one of the first thing to do when you are asked a puzzle in the interview is to think, if it is a variation of one of the puzzles that you already know. If yes, that saves you a lot of time but just don't break into a wide grin to let your interviewer know that you already know the answer. So, here is the puzzle. You love candy and you are given three opaque jars which contain candies that are either blue or pink. One of them is labeled blue, one pink and one blue and pink. Blue jar has only blue candies, pink jar has only pink candies and blue and pink jar has both blue and pink candies. But, all three of them have been mislabeled. You can take out one candy at a time. What is the minimum number of candies that you need to take out to label all three jars correctly? Hint, you can do it by taking out just one candy. Remember, all three jars have been mislabeled. Answer. Where to start? Choosing either the blue or the pink jar is similar in approach. The blue and pink jar seems to be the odd one out so let us begin with this one. The big clue is that all three of them have been mislabeled. Let's see what happens when we take out one candy from the blue and pink. If the candy is blue then the label can be either blue or blue and pink. You know the label is blue and pink but it is mislabeled. So, the only option is blue. Hence the blue and pink label jar is actually blue jar. Now consider the jar labeled pink. Since it is labeled wrong it can either have blue candies or both blue and pink candies. But you have already figured out the blue candy jar so it must be blue and pink candy jar. Now, you take the jar labeled, blue and the only option left is pink. Similarly, if the candy is pink then the label can be either pink or blue and pink. You know the label is blue and pink but it is mislabeled. So, the only option is pink. Hence it is the jar with only pink candies. Now let us consider the jar labeled blue. Since all the jars are mislabeled it has either pink candies or a mix of pink and blue candies. But since we have already figured out the pink candy jar it can only be blue and pink candy jar. Now for the jar labeled pink the only option left is blue. Hence, you need to take out just one candy to label all three of them correctly. If you like this video, you can subscribe us and share our videos with you friends. Thanks for watching.